Okay, today we're going to make a buckyball set that looks pretty much like this. It takes exactly one set of uh, 216 buckyballs to make this, although this actually contains somewhat less than 216, as you will see. So what we're going to do is we're going to start off by making triangles, like so. We're going to make four sets of triangles first. Okay, so they look like this. You've got four, four triangles. Now we're going to put them together, like this. Here I've got more that I've already done. We'll put them together. So we've got two. Two more. Now, that makes basically a uh, cube type thing. Now, we're going to take out the centers, like so. And by the way, the figure that I just assembled is exactly one set of buckyballs. So now that we've taken out the centers of the corners, now we're going to take out the centers here, where you see six of them together that make a little circle. So we're taking these out. Four on top. Flip it over. Four more on bottom. Here we have one, two, three, and there we go. Now, you end up with a shape that has quite a few um, holes in it, as one might imagine. So, now we take the top and the bottom, like so, and push those in just a little bit, and then we do the sides, and we basically make a shape like this. Now we do this one, push it in, Kind of got to fiddle with it a little bit, and it'll they'll all click in. You'll hear them hear them actually click. It sounds like a very positive when they set in. There we go. So now I have one of these. Now take more of these. Now you have this. Okay, this takes um, four sets, or actually this particular shape takes three sets to make because of the extras that you have left over when you pull them apart. Take more. There you go. Now it's a cube with tons of structure on the inside. Very cool set. Uh, this actually takes six sets of buckyballs to make all eight of those little figures. So, enjoy!